Hey everyone, 2025 is here and let me tell you, it's a game changer. Over the last 15 years, I have learned countless skills whether in my academics or in my jobs at a startup or a corporate. But here's the hard truth. Most of these skills are becoming either obsolete or irrelevant. And to top that, this is happening faster than each of the passing years. To put it simply, you can be replaced today in the next two years if you don't upskill yourself. The effect of this skill gap combined with the economic situation and the competition out in the market has resulted in lack of jobs. If you remember in the middle of 2024, there were about 38% of IITNs creme de la creme of the country that could not get placed. Combine this with the massive layoffs happening in the tech and AI industry and you will realize that the world is shifting towards a skill-based economy. But don't worry, if this keeps you up at night, this video will help you solve this problem. So I would recommend watching it till the very end. I'm going to share with you five skills that you require in 2025 to keep yourself upskilled and updated in today's job environment. It doesn't matter whether you are a student, a working professional, or just want to learn any new skill to keep yourself up to date. Skills can broadly be classified into two categories, the hard skills and the soft skills. Hard skills are specific and measurable and can be learned through training and education. Skills such as coding, graphic design, operating a software or a machinery all of these skills are typically called hard skills. Soft skills, on the other hand, are those skills which help you interface with other people. These are interpersonal or personal skills that enable you to communicate and engage with the people around you. Some of these skills include communication, problem solving, emotional intelligence, leadership, teamwork, and many more. So instead of sharing five skills, I will share with you five each of hard and soft skills in this video. Let us begin with top five hard skills in 2025. Number one, artificial intelligence and machine learning developer. AI and ML are some of the coolest things that we already see today. Think about Netflix recommending you the next movie that you should watch or Amazon telling you what is the next product that you should buy. This is exactly the recommendation engine coming into action. Spotify curates your playlist and YouTube tells you which is the next video that should come up in your feed. All of this is driven by AI and ML. In the coming years, this field is only going to pick up creating applications in automotive, healthcare, finance, and much more. Let's be honest, we all know what's coming to us. One cannot survive without having the basic know-how of how AI and ML work. Even functions in a company today, such as an HR function or a marketing function, are using AI tools to drive their initiatives. Nowadays, the AI and ML engineers are being offered packages which are 1.5 to 2 times that of a coder. Furthermore, there is a massive global demand for people having these skills. So even if you are a non-engineer, understanding how AI and ML work is a must skill that you must learn in 2025. And if you want to get started, platforms like Kaggle or Coursera are the good starting points. They offer hands-on courses so that you can practice and learn at the same time. With consistent learning of approximately one to two years, you can be part of this exciting high paying field. Number two, digital marketing. To put it simply, digital marketing is nothing but following the rules of the marketing on a digital platform. However, it may not be that simple unless somebody understands the lingo of the digital world. See, it is like cricket and baseball. In both the sports, you need to score higher than your opponent to win. But the rules of baseball are completely different than the rules of cricket, but the fundamentals remain the same. Digital marketing is all about connecting the businesses to their customers on an online platform. There are so many tools and so many strategies here. Google Ads, LinkedIn Ads, Instagram, Search Engine Optimization, Search Engine Management. Then there are platforms like CRM, Salesforce, and many others that help you drive the digital marketing strategy for any company. Sentiment analysis tools such as Brandwatch help companies identify how people feel about the brand. Similarly, tools like Hootsuite and Buffer help companies manage their social media campaigns. You could specialize in SEO, email marketing, ads and many other things under the digital marketing umbrella. A majority challenge and yet to be picked up skill is digital marketing in today's world. You will be amazed at the demand and supply gap of this skill. Companies today over index on their digital marketing strategy because people today are highly active on a Facebook or a LinkedIn or an Instagram and they want their product to be put out in the market. So the best mediums to go for are the digital platforms today. So digital marketing is one of the key and most important skills of 2025. And mind you, the roles for digital marketing offer handsome salaries. It would take approximately 6 to 12 months 
to learn the basics of digital marketing but staying up to date with the trend is very important in digital marketing you can get started with platforms like udemy or linkedin learning number 3 data science and analytics you must have heard that data is the next fuel imagine working with trillions of rows of data being generated in one second companies like google amazon facebook are collecting every bit of data every second for every user but why simply to understand their user better and customize their product to fit those users in a very very bespoke manner analyzing this data offers great insights about the user's behavior whether they are going to buy a product or not whether they are going to quit from a website or not or they are not going to come on the digital platform again all of these insights can be found and generated using the digital presence of a user hence it is lifeline for these companies to understand this big data in the most deeper manner possible this skill requires learning about statistical modeling concepts of regression and projections data structures database management systems tools like python r tableau and many other aspects to create models around user behavior forecasting optimizing and recommending these experts are offered handsome packages and also these roles are considered to be some of the most interesting roles in a company while it may take 1 to 2 years to master these skills you can get started with some of the platforms like kaggle or data camp remember data science is an ever growing field with no signs of slowing down number 4 programmer for robotics and automation think about tesla's self driving cars or amazon's warehouse robots they are great examples of robotics and automation in the next 5 years the applications of robotic and automation are going to double in the areas of manufacturing healthcare and space exploration companies like boston dynamics are creating robots that can walk jump or even dance if you are interested in creating the tech for tomorrow robotics is the right field for you you see robotics and automation all around you as well imagine doors opening when you go to an airport or machines packaging products in a factory or even when you enter a lift the sensors in the lift can sense you and calculate the number of people in the lift and so on while these products exist already the next leg of innovation is going to come by combining robotics with ai and that should be the number one skill in 2025 given this is some of the most specialized skill the people who are at the core manufacturing or core engineering of any company are offered great packages you can start by learning python c++ or platforms like arduino or raspberry pi it would take 1 to 2 years of focus learning and hands on projects to really get skilled in this field Number 5 web designing and development With a boom in e-commerce and D2C brands in India web design is more important than ever companies need visually stunning and user friendly websites to stand out after all it is all about customer experience in today's world Shopify developers for example are in high demand to create custom websites for any of the brands that want to launch their new website learning tools like html css javascript and frameworks like react or angular can make you a sought after professional in this space with practice and hands on projects you will be ready to handle the advanced web development in just 1 to 2 years i hope these skills and information were valuable to you now let's dive into the top 5 soft skills for 2025 number 1 adaptability and learning agility the pandemic taught us one thing very well that change is constant in 2025 whether it is switching to a hybrid work environment or learning a new skill your agility and the ability to be flexible will guide you through this learning agility means staying curious and ability to accept any sort of a feedback so that you can quickly adjust to new challenges think about how tech professionals had to adjust to new remote tools almost overnight employers love people who can adapt to fast changing environments in the most flexible and agile manner so how can you develop this skill step out of your comfort zone try new tasks try new courses and be open to feedback read some of the books on this phenomena such as mindset by carol dweck in 6 to 12 months you'll notice a big difference number 2 critical thinking and problem solving with remote work and hybrid setups solving problems creatively has become very critical whether it's troubleshooting tech issues or finding new ways to collaborate critical thinking helps you tackle challenges head on for example businesses now need smarter strategies to handle the shifting markets and changing customer needs in a world full of uncertainties companies need people who can think on their feet if you want to improve in this field start questioning the status quo and breaking down the problem into parts solving a lot of puzzles and case studies can help you improve this skill as well read a few books such as thinking fast and slow by daniel kahneman 
which can help you understand a little about how your mind works and how you can think about solving these problems. You'll start seeing progress in 6 to 12 months. Number 3, communication and storytelling. Remote work has made it very clear how important communication is. Whether you're presenting on Zoom or sending an email, good storytelling helps you connect with your audience. Think about leaders who inspired their teams during tough times. They didn't just tell facts, they told stories. These stories resonated with their teams and fueled the call to action. Post-COVID, effective communication is the key to cutting through the noise and building trust. So you must join some of the public speaking groups like Toastmasters or take some of the online storytelling courses. With consistent practice, you will see improvements in the next six months. Number four, collaboration and emotional intelligence. Working from home has shown us how important it is to empathize and understand the emotions of the other person, especially when you're working in a remote manner. We've all seen examples of extreme stress and mental health being compromised because of the nature of the remote working environment. Emotional intelligence helps you build trust, resolve conflict, and keep the teams motivated even if you're not in the same room. For example, a good leader will be able to sense when their teammate is in distress and they step in to help them. In a hybrid work setup, high emotional quotient ensures smoother collaboration and a better mental health. Hence, practice empathy and active listening. Personality tools like DISC or MBTI and books like Emotional Intelligence 2.0 by Travis Bradbury are super helpful. Number 5. Focus and Deep Work With so many distractions around, the ability to focus has become a super power. Deep work helps you get high quality results in lesser time. Whether you are coding, designing or brainstorming, without a highly focused mind, you are unable to deliver good results. Imagine being able to shut out distractions and delivering a project ahead of time. Especially post the pandemic, being focused is the key to remaining productive and also ensuring a good mental health. But building focus requires time. So start today by reducing distractions with time blocking or using the Pomodoro technique. Books like Deep Work by Cal Newport offer practical tips. In three to six months, you can build these habits which can last a lifetime. So with that, we conclude the skills that are required to excel in 2025. And hey, don't forget to check out my other videos on using AI tools to create resume and the tips to cracking an interview, which can help you level up your resume and your career. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.